the advice. Under Section 107 of the U.S. Copyright Act of 1976, allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. Nonprofit, educational, or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. All right, so I wanted to shed some light on an eBay seller who sells Microsoft products and uses the Microsoft logo. I'm doing this video solely for the purpose of others so you don't end up in a shitty situation like I did and end up wasting time or money. This is in no way a hateful review. I'm just sharing my experience and giving you guys my take on what I've been told and what I've seen. So anyway, a quick recap of what happened a few weeks ago. I bought a Series X, thought I was buying it from Microsoft via eBay, but it wasn't. The seller is not Microsoft. Don't let the image or the name fool you. That's what I want you to know out of everything that I say in this short video. So I bought the Series X from the quote unquote Microsoft store on eBay. Got it sent to me after I checked the tracking number online and it said it wasn't here yet. After a few hours went by, I checked outside and there it was just sitting there. And the shipping box was damaged, courtesy of FedEx most likely. It was a pretty flimsy, cheap box to begin with. FedEx actually didn't even ring my doorbell or knock on the door. You know, $531 package just left outside for about three and a half hours. Just another day. Anyway, the shipping box was damaged. The Xbox box, the corners were all nicked up pretty good as well, along with the edges all the way around. I mean, this Series X looked like it was used or refurbished and then sold to me as a brand new system. I would not doubt that at all. So it wasn't all from shipping damage. That's just my take from what I saw close up. I didn't even bother unpacking it because I wasn't taking a chance on it. I returned it. But here's the kicker. I did call Microsoft before I returned it. I talked to a guy that said that they were actually aware of this seller pretty much impersonating Microsoft and that in no way could it be under warranty through Microsoft because the order number was completely different from Microsoft's site. The little piece of paper that came with this box within a shitty box that said Microsoft at the top, yeah, on the fake Microsoft order sheet, yeah, that was all a ploy to get you to believe that it was from Microsoft. So anyway, yeah, don't buy from the so-called Microsoft store on eBay because it's not them and you will not get a warranty. If you want a warranty, you have to buy it from Microsoft's site directly or from a store retailer. But good luck finding one at a retailer still after all these years, especially if you live near my area. Anyway, that's my take on this. It's not the official Microsoft eBay store. And for the record, as you saw in the pics, there was no shipping eggs or AirPods to protect the system which Microsoft probably would do. So, thanks for listening. And make sure you get your stuff from the official site of the company that makes whatever you are trying to buy, especially if it's an expensive item. Or get it from a store or retailer. Don't make the same mistake I made. That's my advice.